welcome to my channel. Um, I make home education videos, vloggy style, with my seven-year-old daughter Rosie. Really sorry if I look really tired in this one. Um, I didn't get much sleep last night. I don't know why I couldn't sleep, just couldn't sleep. Is it really worrying about Jake again? No, nope, I wasn't worrying about anybody. I just couldn't sleep. My brain just would not oh, switch got off. Got a bit yellow on arms, do so, Oh, um, my it's supposed to be yellow. Honey, it's your, it's your oh, thing. I'll to just turn you around and show you what she's doing. So, today is Tuesday and we have... We were meant to go to the lake, but everyone kind of bailed on the lake in our group. They all messaged to say they weren't going. So, we went to the library and got some new books out. And um, when we were in town yesterday, uh, Rosie picked something to buy with her pocket money, which was this paint-your-own princess figure, and she picked Belle. So she's doing a little bit of art right now, painting Belle. Um, Perfect. She might not get it all done now because it's not too long before dinner time, Tea. but she can certainly start it. first try so any attempt is better than nothing if you're trying not my first try uh, paint by numbers it is is it yeah the start of this it was so good. we've got to the end of the week rosie's gone off to her dad's and um i've realized i forgot to film a lot of stuff she got given this share bear on um monday for beavers that we were going to take on an um an adventure one day this week um the weather wasn't nice on tuesday we ended up at the library um and a little bit of the park uh wednesday we were meant to have a friend come and stay with us um which kind of threw a spanner in our works for our thursday because we weren't sure if they were still going to turn up or not it was kind of they weren't very well and we weren't sure if they were still still coming they hadn't been very clear about what was happening um, so Thursday we ended up back down the park, we ended up watching the river and talking about um, what floats down the river, what lives in the river and things, it's like a science thing. We looked for signs of autumn. Um, as much as I like being child-led, I am going to try and put a little bit more structure into Rosie's day, just because I'm, there's, there's more things that I need to just sit down and make a list of, right, I want her to better do this before the end of this year. So we're just going to have some goals to achieve this year. Um, one might be being able to ride a bike um, or making sure she's booked in for the intensive swim lessons next summer. So she's swimming. Um, so they're then all not, not, not all necessarily going to be academic. I would also like her to get a little bit further on the keyboard. So we might try and fit that practice in a bit more regularly. And I might see if she can get into a routine now because she hasn't, I haven't wanted to push that um, to destroy the enjoying of learning because I like the fact she loves to learn. Um, but I might start trying to implement a practice routine for her to get her into um, that because she watches me practice every day. So she knows it's important. She knows it's part of being a musician if she wants to be one. Um, yeah, and I need to um, start making my sheets again because I used to make a load of sheets and I've kind of dropped the ball recently on. Um, there's been stuff going on with me that I've not... I've not been my usual organised self and I'd like to get a little bit of that back. It's been nice going with the flow and it's been nice learning how to go with the flow, but I think we need just a little bit of structure now, um, including uh, making sure Rosie can write all her little letters by the end of this year as well. Reading-wise, she's just doing amazing. And um, yeah, so this week we've kind of done a lot of outdoor learning and music and Rosie's been writing her own song. And, um, yeah, it's been a bit more of an arty week. We've done art and lots of things like that. So, um, yeah. Um, I think just because you have one of those weeks where you haven't sat down and learnt much, that it's, I don't think that means your child's learnt nothing because they're constantly learning. And Rosie just comes out with information that I'm like, whoa, where'd you learn that? And um, she's actually managed to find something out on her own. So... Tech is another thing for the next coming year. I want to implement some sort of 
tech program with her so that she's learning how to use Google and how to type and um, some other basic stuff on a computer and I might have to find her a coding class because it's not my strong point. So um, uh, yeah, I might have to find her somewhere to do all that stuff. Um, but for now, uh, we're enjoying our arts and the last of the sunshine being out. So I'm sure we'll have plenty of time for all the indoor sit down stuff coming up with the winter. And uh, tell us how your year changes with the seasons, with the home ed. Autumn is my favourite time of year, so we're looking forward to this. Um, yes, and we've got some shows coming up again. So for now, I'll say hope you enjoyed the video and it's the tar from me and the tar from the Rosie Bear.